this is page scope data administrator uh, we're going to create four pin codes for Konica Minolta BizHub machines and then once we've created four we're going to export those four from one Konica BizHub to another Konica BizHub so first of all we find our two Konica BizHub photocopiers we search uh, I'm going to stop the search there because I found my two it's uh, IPs ending 43 and 56 so I'll highlight those two lines and select them and then OK down the bottom password will be 123456781234567 1234567 username and password that is so that's it we've, we've registered the devices within PageScope Data Administrator and now we can think about editing the user's uh, account track settings pin codes first of all we're going to look at the two machines so uh, this is the first one and on this machine I'm going to check that account track is turned off otherwise uh, when you use PageScope Administrator uh, passwords 1234567812345678 yeah, when you use um, PageScope Administrator, it doesn't actually cut it errors if, if account tracks on. So I'll just show you where to check. Uh, it's here, and we're looking for account track off and uh, account track input method off. So we know that's that machine's empty. It's just a walk-up machine with no password. So now we're going to look at our donor machine, the machine that's going to have the uh, account track pin codes entered into it. We log in as administrator the same. I can tell it's got pin codes because it's got an account box at the top. Click log in there. 1234567812345678. OK it. Go to user authentication account track. general settings, account tracks on and uh, input methods password only so just users just going to edit enter a four digit code so we're going to clear what data is in the machine and ok that now I'm going to go to account track settings and enter my three example users so four digit pin code that the user types when they walk up to the machine user one we could set them allowances and uh, limitations on whether they can print full color or black here or we could say they can only print in mono whatever you want just have to bear with me while I enter three of these. So, different password for the next user. Different username. Just one more to go. If you've already got your users in the machine and you want to uh, export them from one machine to the other, uh, as long as you've got account track turned off on the machine that's going to receive the PIN codes, you could skip this creation part. You could stay within PageScope Data Administrator. Always make sure you're logged out as administrator on both machines before you try and import or export the data. So back in uh, PageScope Data Administrator, it goes to settings for multiple devices, copy authentication and address data collectively. 
that's the one we're after. And then uh, tick the first box, authentication, and then uh, next. Okay, select the donor machine, the machine that's got the PIN codes in. I like that one, ours is 43. Connect to the device. If it's an older an older task alpha machine, the password would be just uh, one two three four five six seven eight. And here we select the uh, the target machine, the machine that's going to receive the pin codes. So we highlight the line, select next, and uh, see it processing there. And now we're going to uh, it's, re it's read the donor account codes. It knows where to to process them to and now it's going to uh, start pushing the user account codes to the to the machine that's receiving them. Yours will take a lot longer than this. I've I cut cut that section down, took about two minutes in reality and then it ends. And now if you went to the donor machine uh, so my IP is fifty six sorry not the donor machine, if you go to the, the machine receiving the pin code which is fifty six uh, can let me log in as administrator. One two three four five six seven eight. One two three four five six seven eight. User authentication account track. And there you can see account tracks on password only. And there's my three user accounts. And that's it, we're all done. I uh, hope that works for you.